I love overalls. Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel or welcome to my channel if you're new here. My name's Ashley. Uh, hopefully this quarantine's almost over, right? When you're watching this, it's gonna be like the first week of May already, so... I mean, fingers crossed, hopefully we're close. <laughs> While we're still in quarantine, we can prepare for when it's over and when it's over, hopefully, it will be summer. And one of my favorite pieces of clothing in the summer is overalls. I love overalls. I love them. In my video where I figured out how to take Instagram pictures in quarantine, if you had seen that, which is linked right here if you didn't see it. Um, I was wearing these overalls actually for one of my pictures and somebody commented on that video and was like, can you do a video on how you style your overalls? And I was like, yes. Like, oh my gosh, that's so exciting. First of all, it's my first like requested video. So thank you, appreciate that. And I just love any excuse to put overalls on. I love overalls, they're so great. You just get a thumbs up down below if you like overalls so as you can see by the mess behind me um i already filmed the video <laughs> but i realized that i forgot to do an intro and i wanted to do that before the sun went down so yes in this video i'm gonna be showing how i style my overalls for spring and for summer so i have three different pairs of overalls i have two pairs of overall shorts one's like dark one's light the light one is like looser the dark ones are a little tighter i had also filmed how I style like long overalls, but I think that this video is gonna be a little bit too long, I think. So if you do wanna see that video as well, let me know down below. And I can totally make a separate video of how to style long overalls. <laughs> Without further ado, let's just get into the video. Oh, I'm so excited. This is like my favorite video ever. The first way to wear overalls is by themselves with nothing underneath. This is super cute for summer and I just paired it with this hair scarf to add a little bit of something to the outfit. This isn't gonna work with every single pair of overalls though. The front isn't always gonna cover what it needs to cover, but one thing you can do is add a belt like this and that'll help hold the front in place to keep everything in that needs to be held in. Since it's summer, you can pair it with sneakers or sandals or whatever you want. If you do wanna wear something underneath, then you can wear a little tube top like this or even a tank top and pair it with some matching accessories. Or you could literally just wear like a sports bra or probably a regular bra, but I wouldn't be comfortable in that. So I would just wear a sports bra and match it with some sneakers for a nice like comfy casual look and even add a little bit of a belt for some accessories. Or, since it's summer, we might be going to the beach and so you can wear a bathing suit underneath and you're all ready. You just take the overalls off and you're good to go. And if I was going to the beach, I would probably pair this with sandals, but you could wear sneakers to the beach too if you would like. But either way, it's just a nice like summery casual look. What you can also do is take the strap off and I tuck it in the back. I don't like to leave it dangling and then just fold the front forward a little bit so that you can see more of your bathing suit, more of that summer bod that you've been working so hard on. <laughs> and going to the beach, I don't really like to carry a purse so I just have this little Louis Vuitton bag that I would wear as like a belt bag or like a fanny pack just to hold my stuff in. One of my favorite ways to wear any overall, short or long, is to wear a sweater underneath. Um, this is just like a knit sweater and I have it tucked in because it looks really weird if it's hanging out the sides and I just have it paired with some sneakers for just like a cute and casual look. I think overalls are just casual all around. <laughs> You can either wear a sweater like that or a sweatshirt. I think a crew neck sweatshirt would look best. I think a uh, like a hoodie would be a little bit too much, but I'm just tucking it in so that it's not sticking out and rolling up the sleeves. And this is for like those cooler spring or summer nights when you still want to go out with your friends, but it's a little bit chilly, but you still want to look nice and 
summery with your overalls. <laughs> and again, just have it paired with some sneakers and a belt to add a little bit something extra. So I have a few different t-shirts in this video. This is just a normal band t-shirt. It's loose, it's not cropped, literally just like a normal t-shirt. And I'm tucking it in all around because otherwise it looks really like weird and bulgy. And I added like a little hair scarf for some accessories and also Converse. And yeah, this is super like comfy, casual, chilling around the house kind of an outfit. You can also do what you did with the bathing suit top and take the strap off and again tuck it in the back so that it's not dangling everywhere and fold the front forward so you can see more of the t-shirt and then you just have a super cute outfit but with more of your t-shirt and less of your overalls like covering the t-shirt if that makes sense. Again, if it's a little bit of a cooler or like windier summer day or something, you could always wear a long sleeve shirt. This is just a loose fitting long sleeve shirt that I have tucked in and I have some matching accessories with it, but you could also wear a shorter, this one's cropped, um, like tighter shirt. It's going to pop out of the sides no matter how much you tuck it in, but they both look super cute, just different kinds of looks and you can add accessories to dress it up a little bit, not dress it up, but like add a little bit extra to the outfit and wear some different shoes if you want. I think sneakers would look best with most of these outfits. I love sneakers and overalls together just in general. And the dancing can go with any outfit. It doesn't need to be just this one. <laughs> If you want to dress it up a little bit more, you could add an off-the-shoulder shirt. So here I have a long sleeve off-the-shoulder top. And then I also have a short sleeve off-the-shoulder top. I love the short sleeve one. It makes me feel like I'm going on like a cute little picnic in the park or something. I don't know. Um, and I just used my boyfriend's tie as a headband, which I think added something super cute to this outfit. And yeah, I love like the overall straps with the off the shoulder look. I think it looks super cute and this would look so nice with some sandals like these. Um, I don't know what these are called, espadrilles maybe? Or just regular sandals. Another one of my favorite ways to wear overalls is with a three-quarter sleeve shirt underneath. So this one is full length and I'm just tucking it into the overalls and it says whatever mom. This is like my favorite one to wear under overalls for some reason. Uh, I don't know why this look just makes me feel like I should be in a movie, like I'm a 20-something trying to figure stuff out, maybe moving apartments or something. I don't know, that's just what this outfit makes me think of. And you can add accessories if you'd like and some sneakers and all of that same for every outfit <laughs> this is like a super casual chill and look and you can do the same thing where you tuck or pull down the front of the overalls and tuck the strap in another one of the outfits i like to wear with short sleeve shirts underneath is a looser and cropped short sleeve shirt so this is definitely shorter than the other shirt but not cropped so much that it's like you can see my whole stomach or anything uh, i like this because you can see the design on top of the overalls only on this pair of overalls not in the other one and then i just added a matching scrunchie and this i would also probably wear with sneakers at a belt if i felt so inclined and yeah, this is also super casual, nice for summer, but you won't get sunburn on those shoulders because they're not exposed. And just the loose fitting makes it look a lot more casual, I think, like the loose fitting t-shirt.
So say you're wearing a tank top or tube top or bikini top or even like a t-shirt and it gets a little bit chilly outside, you can always just throw a flannel on. An oversized flannel looks super like nice and comfy, casual with overalls. You can even add in a belt to like accessorize a little bit. Uh, the plaid kind of makes me feel like I'm a farmer, but not so not that much because it's black and so I don't feel like that much of a farmer. Um, if it was red, I would definitely feel like a farmer <laughs> with overalls and a plaid shirt. That was my farmer dance. Or if you didn't want to add a flannel, you can just add a sweatshirt over top, um, a zip up sweatshirt. I would probably add, I don't think a pullover one would look, it would just look like shorts, I guess. <laughs> uh, but this is just a cropped little sweatshirt from Brandy Melville. And I think the crop looks nice because you can see a good part of the overalls from the back. So it looks like just shorts and a shirt. It doesn't look like overalls in the back. But in the front, you can very clearly tell that it's overalls. And yeah, I think it's cute. Add a little belt, you know, spice it up a little bit. And this is my absolute favorite outfit. I think I look like a little baby, but in a good way. So I just have this tight short sleeve shirt that's tucked in obviously it's a little bit cropped and I think that this looks so cute because the overalls are looser so then you have something tight underneath and it's just like a good mixture dynamic thing I use my boyfriend's tie as a headband again and for the other outfit I just added a cute little pink scrunchie you can also add a belt just to give the overalls a little bit more shape and again I would add wear this outfit with sneakers I also added the little Louis Vuitton belt bag with the other outfit, again, to do the same thing as the belt, give it a little more shape, you know. The end. All right, and that is the video. Thank you all so much for watching. I hope that you enjoyed watching it as much as I enjoyed making it. Again, I love any excuse to put overalls on. Overalls are great. Yeah, so most of these outfits were either outfits that I have worn or outfits that I have not worn but I like and will be wearing probably <laughs> or would wear at some point if the occasion and the weather permitted. Um, the belt with the overalls was a totally new thing for me. I never liked it on myself but I loved it on other people so I thought I would give it a try for this video and I actually fell in love with it while I was doing this video. So if anything good comes out of this, I like how overalls look with a belt. <laughs> all right, well, thank you all so much for watching. Again, let me know down below if you wanna see the How I Style long overalls video and I can get that up for you. Also, if you do wanna see that video, make sure that you subscribe and turn on the notifications so that you don't miss it because that would be sad. <laughs> yeah, I'll see you all next week. I don't know why I keep doing that. Little crazy arms. <laughs> I'll see you all next week in my next video. And until then, stay safe and stay healthy. And I'll see you then. Bye.